Hi guys, welcome back to About Tonight. My name's Nina Oyama. I'm the guest host for this evening. Um, and we have another guest on tonight. He's pretty amazing, he's a comedian. He's come all the way from the UK just to do this show. Um, let's bring him on, it's Phil Wang. Which seat should I? Any seat that you want to. It's like it's such a big desk to shake hands over. Like I feel I'm just like. G yeah, you should get a smaller desk. Yeah. What? Oh, sorry. I'm just admiring the Sydney skyline. Oh uh, uh, yeah. Are we in very Sydney? Low. Are we in Melbourne? Who knows? Ambiguous. No. I'm, it is. I didn't even notice it was a rocking chair. It isn't. I'm, I'm like damaging just the. Done that with your legs. feet. Yeah. Yeah. Just, just crippling the set. Yeah, I yeah. Gotta, I gotta, and I'm yeah, it's a rock star lifestyle, man. You just from from the UK mm. tries to few fair. Well, I flew all the way over here. I'm gonna get yeah, I get you. some damage out of it. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So how you been? You're here for the comedy festival, um, am I right? Yeah, of course you know, I'm right. You're, you're I know I've seen your show actually. Oh yeah. Um, but still not your favorite comedian though. Oh no, my favorite comedian's actually coming on. Yeah, next, no, okay. So I just wanted to make sure. Yeah. Um, you like my? I'm amazing. Like but my seventh, I'm not. Like my, my seventh favorite comedian. Okay. It's like top ten, but like. Someone's a lucky number. Yeah, Some, yeah. You're someone. Not mine. <laughs> Seven's like my least favorite number. Oh, okay, but, um, sure. Yeah. yeah, number seven. That's cool. But no, like, let's, let's chat. Like, how do you find, like, Australia compared hate to the it. UK? Absolutely you hate horrible. it. Absolutely. You hate it? Why? Ah, uh, so much space. Can't, no one's trying to hurt me. It's ugh, yuck. You like when people try and hurt so you? So many Asian people. So many Asian oh, people. Everywhere. <laughs> Can't move for them. I believe that. I'm not. There's nothing special about me here. I'm just a comedian here. Yeah. Back home, I'm I'm the Chinese guy. I know. You're telling me. Yeah, but here I'm just some asshole. Yeah. Well, I feel like you're always just some well, asshole. Some you're asshole. like you're like asshole and like Chinese and not like mutually exclusive things. No, I, I'm the cross section on a Venn diagram of yeah. Chinese and asshole. No, I have the same thing because actually I live in the country. I live in Bathurst, New South Wales, which is like in the middle of nowhere. So like I'm as Asian as it gets out there. Like that's pretty much because both do, of our are dads people are racist are, to you out there. Oh yeah, people are like. What do they do? Uh, throw stuff. <laughs> uh, no, I don't think people are that racist <laughs> towards me. <laughs> just throw stuff they, yeah, they just throw stuff. Oh, there, there's, there, there it is, and they just throw it. Yeah. Oh no, actually, I eat have a potato. Like, you. Yeah. It. No, I don't get thrown. I get like internet. I got internet bullied for being Asian, um, like a few weeks ago. Okay. But I was like, it's never happened to me, so I just thought it was really on Twitter. Funny. No, on, on Facebook, oh. they were like, I was commenting on something, and they're like. That Asian can fuck off, and I was like, "Well, I was just really confused." <laughs> Maybe you can. Like, I don't know. Maybe they have a point. Well, what did yeah. you say? Well, like I don't see race, so I was just really confused. I was like, "Cause I just see everyone as Asian. That's kind of that's how I." It's I quite a good approximation, actually. Yeah, and like the thing is, speaking. there's even like a comedian, Harry Kondabolu, who says like by 2042, like everyone's gonna be mixed race. Like there'll be no like mm. pure white people, which yeah. is um good because. It will be the super White race, people. yeah. It but it'll be, be fine to call it that because everyone will be it. Yeah, yeah, it'll be awesome. Like the, yeah. It's totally okay to be racist if that's the only race there is. Well, I don't think you can be racist because you just be embracing. You'll so be I'm a, a, you could be an embracist. It's like totally cool to be a supremacist if there's literally no one else. Yeah, that is being true. That's just being a humanist. Yeah, I don't know. Like I just, I'm just excited for like. I was gonna say for white people to stop talking, but I'm just like, I'm thinking, just the other day I was like in line at this place and someone was like, you know, I went to like a coffee shop and they said they had espresso, but they only had Nespresso. And I was just like, T just just never talk ever again. Like, <laughs> just, I don't know if that's like a race thing or just a class thing though. Cause I feel okay. like I'm uh, from there's the a lot of There's a lot of factors at play there, I think. Yeah, but I was gonna say like, I think it's really weird cause we're both half Asian, right? Yeah, well, but together we're, there's, well, yeah. there's one Asian person on this stage. Exactly. Right now. But, like, I guess there's one Asian person and one white person. Yeah. Um, yeah. And, but I wonder how they'd get on. Yeah. Probably, probably really well, and they probably have a baby and then make one of us, either of us. 
Yeah. Mm, yeah anyway, mm. I was just going to say, like, is it is it weird? Have you met people with like an Asian father? Because most people no. have a white mother. No, have an Asian mother and a white father. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's it's normally like Asian lady and mm. creepy white guy. Yeah, that's like that's like the standard. That's, yeah. No offense to all the other half Asians. But my dad is one of the only guy, ones who like f fucked upwards. Yeah, yeah. And somehow n n nailed the white chick. <laughs> yeah. Like that, he's my hero. My dad, yeah. He showed us. We, oh, she, he showed us all. It's possible. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. So your dad. Well, my dad's Japanese yeah. as well. Like my okay. mom's white. So. Yeah, our, he, our dads are fucking players. Yeah, they're like the baller. They're like the kings. Mm. Yeah, they yeah. They set it up for the rest of us. Yeah. I mean, not you, I guess. Not me. No, I. Yeah, no. Oh yeah, because I, I I just have to end up with a creepy a creepy guy with you're yellow. You're probably gonna you're, you're yeah. gonna end up with a white guy with a ponytail, who's really into anime and learnt Japanese to hit on you. I wish there were more of them, really. I wish, like... Oh, there are plenty. Yeah, are there? Mm, yeah. Well, show me, because I have really low self-esteem. So yeah, there's I'll probably a couple anything. in the studio. I'll take... Oh, these guys? No, 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 I mean, in the whole thing. Konnichiwa. What's up, babe? Hey. Oh, yeah, these guys, yeah. How you doing? All right, God. Hey. <laughs> hmm. I, 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 I just like them. that they're I the house them. band, like as long as well, I had to put on, I had to get an AVO against them uh, in the break an for, AVO. for like two meters. Yeah, it was a two meter AVO, so they can only encircle me. But they were very close just then. One of them threw something. Oh yeah, it was like in the break. It was in the break because of because of the incident, you know. Oh yeah. And um, would you like this pen? I've been trying to shift this pen after everyone. Why don't people want it? What's wrong with it? I, I don't know. I think it's, it's cursed. A sharpie. It's it is a sharpie. Um, mm. good for. Okay. Does yeah. everyone do, is that like the most common reaction here? Does everyone just <laughs> sniff the jabbies? Because where I'm from, like you pocket it and then you like graffiti stuff. They were in like a, they were initially invented as as a nasal yeah, drug, really? and then people found out the color stick. All right, Phil. We actually have a special game, especially okay. for you tonight. Yeah. Um, I don't know if you play this. We used to play this at camp. It's the Jaffa game. What um, camp? And I think this is going to be what the camp cider. Was it? What camp? Yeah. I don't know, school camp. Okay. But take these chopsticks. School um, this camp? Is you gonna mean school? Yeah. You know, did you go yeah, to we're school? Yes, every day. Yeah, good. We didn't call it camp. Like, yeah, that's why just you can... It's school. It's a building. You know, use proper grammar and, and are eloquent. But we played this game and basically... I you think you're at an advantage here because these are Japanese chopsticks. That is true. But I got them from a sushi shop that was run by Korean people. So, like... That still doesn't Who help. knows? Who knows? Asia. No, anyway, so the goal is you have to put as many Jaffas into your little box what as you these? can. These are called Jaffas. Did okay. you know what a Jaffa is? No idea. Um, are they like a rat poison? Yes. No, <laughs> they're, they, they're like little balls. Like you. I can see that, but... Did um, you ever... They, they've got chocolate inside them. Okay. They're famous for like you roll them down... Because the, movie aisles used to be really slanted and you used to just roll them down the movie aisles for fun. Okay. I don't and know. Would you watch a movie? You'd no, you just home. roll the jab. You didn't. Yeah. yeah, they were cheap back then. Like right. they weren't. Like it wasn't eighteen dollars a pop. It's so it was just it was more the jaffas were the really expensive and fun part. That was my movies were so shit back then because no one actually went no to watch movies. Watched, they didn't even turn the sound on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. they just let the kids roll. The yeah, they were in black and white. Like no one was there. They just that's why the red jaffas like. No one paid attention to a movie until Rocky. Pretty much. Um, anyway, so okay, do you so want to? I, I think we do you want to play this game? I mean, I've given no, you all the nah, utensils that you've got to. I don't think I want to play, actually. You're oh, come on. Get into the improv spirit. Yes, and Phil Wang. Yes. <laughs> I just realized your name is Phil Wang. <laughs> oh my god, your name sounds like Phil Wang. Sorry. No, no it, it is doesn't. Phil Wang. It is. No, it's. Okay, what no, what does so it sound like? What do you, what it's like, you know, there's. Don't worry. No, Do please, you know please. It sounds what is like, it? like F E E L. Feel. What? Yeah, like feel. Do you? Um, you I'm yeah. surprised you don't have a bit about that. Um, I think it speaks for itself. I don't really think I need to elaborate. Yeah, that's true. On, on like your name is out like a set of instructions for a potential suitor, really. Well, it's you know. Have you read the game? It's all about implanting subtle messages. Yeah. Um. I, so, but if I over egg that I want every woman to feel my wang, they won't. Yeah, that is true. All right, anyway, we've only, we're about to run out of time, so let's play this game. Can we get a track for the, the Jaffa game? <laughs> Are you ready? All right. Yeah. And go. Chopsticks. <laughs> it's hard.
harder than you think, right? Can you try a pentatonic scale? No. It's Thanks, got, man. it's like the five chords. I'm mean, in the five notes in like Asian. Phil Wang. <laughs> Sounds like, it reminds me of like grab dicks. Is that your best friend's name, Phil Wang? It's my dad and my mum's name. Grab dicks. There's so many more Jaffas than... All right, can you count us out? Six. Can you give us a 10, 10 second countdown, Jacqueline James? Because I don't think we're going to make it. No? 10, 9, 8, 7, seven 6. This is stupid. Sorry. Um, 3, give up. 2, 1. I win! I win! Oh. Good game. That's how you play the Jaffa game. Anyway, thank you for coming on about tonight, Phil Wang. Thank you, Nina. <laughs> it's These, my pleasure. Mm. Feel free to come on about tonight anytime when I'm hosting again. When okay. And I'll I'm gonna I come back right Victor. after I leave. Yeah, you have to go back through the curtain. Okay. That's the door. Okay. Hey, I'll see you later.